Hi, welcome to this week's History Show with Holly. Today I want to talk about a book I did not enjoy. It's called Summer at Mount Hope by Rosalie Hamm. Um, you may know this author, Rosalie Hamm, as the author of The Dressmaker, which was recently made into a film. I haven't read it or seen the film, and after reading Summer at Mount Hope, I don't want to. Um, it's a story, it's in your set in a sort of pastoral landscape just around, just out of Geelong in the late 18th century and it's about struggling, you know, white families on the land, a struggling vigneron trying to make grapes work in a world of sheep and crops and uh, wheat crops. But, and it, like it should be good. It's something I'm interested in. I love historical fiction. I love reading about Australians battling to make it on the land. Um, I really enjoy those those topics, and yet it's boring. Like the the pace is so slow, and the, even though I'm listening to it by audiobook, and the um, narrator that's reading it is doing descriptions, they're just I mean, not descriptions, sorry, voices. They're boring. They're just they're not very good, and they don't seem authentic. And so that's probably colouring my, my viewing of it, which is a bit unfair to Rosalie Hamm. But I'm just finding the pace too slow and the character descriptions, whilst descriptive, not vivid. You know what I mean? There's no flair. There's no sophistication in her writing. It's like it's been written for a project or something. It's not. There's no love. There's no feeling in it. Anyway, so I don't think I'm going to finish it. I find it really boring. Anyway, but it does, you know, it is relevant to the challenges that we face, people face on the land, the drought, the scarcity of water, the inequity of of labour, of, of jobs during the depression, the capacity of women to, you know, it's just getting into a part about women's suffrage and women's suffragettes have just disrupted a local agricultural show. It's really good, like all this stuff that I would usually be really into. But just, I'm not, it's not doing it for me. So I wouldn't recommend it. But I'll see if I can finish it because I do like to finish a book um, and I'll let you know if it gets any better. But otherwise, yeah, Rosalie Ham, Summer at Mount Hope, wouldn't recommend it. Okay, thanks for listening. Bye.